me, do you like dancing? Well, I do. I totally love dancing. Hi, I am Niharika and welcome back to a new lesson. In today's lesson, we are going to look at some expressions related to dance. So tell me, do you like dancing? Well, I do. I totally love dancing. Well, dance is an art of movement of your body, of course, uh, with using a lot of gestures and expressions, and you dance to music. So, in today's world, people go out dancing, or they dance at home, or they just dance because they love dancing. Now, there are many expressions related to dance in English, and that would help you to talk about it more. So, let's get started with this. The very first expression that I have for you here is put on your dancing shoes. Now, put on your dancing shoes means to get ready to dance. So, in many um, invites, you would often see that, okay, we are having a cocktail party or we are having a birthday party, so put on your dancing shoes. So, it doesn't mean that you put on some nice shoes. The actual meaning of this expression is that you need to get set. You need to be ready to dance, okay? So, so you get ready to dance, to have a lot of fun. So your friend comes and tells you, oh, Tina, why don't you just get ready? We are going clubbing tonight. Put on your dancing shoes. So it means that you guys are going clubbing. So you have to be all ready to dance and to have a lot of fun, okay? So that's how you would use this expression. Let's have a look at the next one here, have two feet. Okay, so now let's imagine that you've reached the club and probably you don't like dancing or probably you're not very comfortable. You dance in a very awkward manner. You're not that great in dancing like your friend is. So, if someone comes and asks you for a dance, well, if you're not comfortable and you think that you're not that great in it, you would say, oh, I'm sorry, I have two left feet. So, two left feet means that you dance um, very awkwardly or probably you're not that great. So you're not that great of a dancer, okay? So it means that you have two left feet, okay? The third one is to boogie. So to boogie means to dance on rock and roll music. So probably the club that you go to is playing rock and roll tonight. So it's time to boogie. So let's boogie tonight. It means to dance on rock and roll. Okay, so, you know, it's a very upbeat dance where you just move around and you have a lot of fun dancing. So that's rock and roll music. I'm sure many of us love dancing on rock and roll music. So rather than just saying I'm dancing to the rock and roll music, you can say, well, I am going to boogie tonight on this rock and roll music. Okay, the next one is strut your stuff. Well, strut your stuff means to enjoy dancing and especially in a very confident manner. Like probably your friend. Look at her, she is strutting her stuff. It means she's really enjoying dancing, okay? And she's dancing in a very confident manner, especially uh, when she wants to be noticed by other people. So if you are in a club and you wanna get noticed by people, then you need to strut your stuff. It means you need to dance confidently. You need to enjoy dancing on the dance floor. So strut your stuff is enjoy dancing and dancing confidently. So you dance in a very confident manner in order to be noticed by others. Okay, so that's strut your stuff for you. The next one, a slow dance. So have you ever had a slow dance with someone? Well, trust me, it's beautiful and it's very romantic. 
So a slow dance is a very slow, uh, on a very slow music, you dance with your partner in a very romantic manner, you swing to the music. Okay, so a slow dance is a romantic partner dance. Okay, so probably you're at a club, you meet someone who's very attractive and you like this guy and you start having a slow dance with him. It means that you dance in a very romantic manner, you swing to the music and you're really having a good time. Okay, so that's a slow dance for you. A very similar uh, expression to this one is dance cheek to cheek. So dance cheek to cheek is also another form of dance, another form of slow dance, okay, where you dance in a very romantic manner and you get very close to your partner, just like your cheeks are touching to his or her cheek. Okay, so that's to dance cheek to cheek. So again, it is a very romantic dance. Like if you have to use this in a sentence, you would say, oh, look at her dancing cheek to cheek with Tony. So it means that you are talking about someone who's dancing with Tony in a very romantic manner. Okay, or probably having a slow dance. Okay, now let's go to another expression here, burn up the dance floor. So enough of romantic dance, enough of a slow dance. Now let's talk about burning up the dance floor. So when you talk about someone who just burned the dance floor, it means someone who is dancing amazingly and totally rocking on the dance floor. So if your friend or you are having a great time dancing on the floor and you're just enjoying it and you're dancing in a very nice manner, then you are burning up the dance floor. So if someone comes and tells you, hey girl, you burned up the dance floor. So it means that you were dancing amazingly. So it means you were noticed by many people. So burn up the dance floor means enjoy dancing, dance amazingly, and of course, people really notice you. Okay, I'm just gonna write to dance a lot and to dance amazingly, okay? Uh, the last one is dance the night away. So dance the night away, it means that you have spent the entire night on the dance floor. So you didn't take a break, okay? You just kept on dancing, dancing, and you spend the whole night dancing on the dance floor. So when someone says you dance the night away, so it means that you danced continuously on the dance floor and in fact it's morning time okay so you dance the whole night again if you really enjoy dancing it means that you dance the night away so if you enjoy dancing you are gonna spend your time on the dance floor right so that's dance the night away for you so hope these expressions help you to talk about dance okay and if you really enjoy dancing then please go ahead use it or if your partner enjoys dancing then please use these expressions for her or him i'll be back with a new lesson for you till then you take care and have a great day